Hey, what's up, guys? Bab Dap here, and another episode of Tell the Bazuria. I'm trying to like a typical YouTuber, stereotypical YouTuber, if I may be exact with myself here. I'd like to come with some Bab Dap. What's going on? I'm I'm here to tell you that you're watching Tell the Bazuria episode. <laughs> yes, right. And we're gonna get right into the mix. Here we go, guys. Hey, yeah, stereotypical YouTuber. Here we go. I'm, uh, that was a joke, by the way. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, uh, what the fork is going on with this? Oh, a cat's thing. Uh, excuse me, sir. And a soul? Oh, shit, dude. What's up there? Oh, that's the end. Well, let's open this. Oh, <laughs> guys, my eyes instantly go to... No, okay, here's, here's how my mind works when it comes to these things. Alright, so I, I go, man, I hope this thing isn't expensive. And then the first thing I look at is my current Casper. It's like, what the fork that mean? That's all I got. But then I realize, like, oh, it's, it requires 35. <laughs> anyway, you found a cat. Did I? I did. Rose, oh, yeah. Oh, wait, no, it's a ro Rose Corsage. I got sneeze. <laughs> uh, Alright, cool. Moving on. Hey, did you hit that out or leave it in? Not oh, you little prick. He didn't have to say anything. I, 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 I just looked at his face. I just know he, he... Ooh, that little batch. That, my editor, guys, he's, an, he's a douchebag. Anyway, I'm the editor. <laughs> Nothing. It's not funny. Well, fork, fork me, right? <laughs> yeah, join heal, everybody. Give me a hand. All right. This guy just has a flint and steel in his pocket all the time. Man, this guy is a legit pirate. I tell you what. I know I am supposed to switch back to um, Velvet because it's awkward looking at this 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 guy's backside the whole time. What are you doing? Oh shit! About to die. Uh, if I leave this screen right here, I will definitely die. Up. Here we go. Oh, you missed. Ah! I wish I had power like that. I'd forget about it if I were you. A pendant fashion from Amber. Cool. What are you doing? Titles! Titles! Are you a turtle demon or something? No, no. You got it all wrong. I'm the white turtles. Sorry about spooking you, Zol. If you're not a demon, then perhaps you're a Moloch. Nope. I'm just a plain old turtles. Nothing more and nothing less. I'm sure you guys have lots of questions about me, but for now, I'd appreciate it if you could hold off on them. Uh, right. Sure, if you insist. Much obliged. The Turtles are traveling merchants of considerable savvy. Their services could be quite useful for members of the underworld like us. You don't say. Sounds handy. You betcha! And at Old White Turtle Shop, we believe the customer's smile is what matters most. That being said, this being where it is, my prices, unfortunately, might be a little on the high. Oh no, you're going to give us a bargain. I'd love to do that, Cease. But when you do business out in remote areas like this, the costs add up and, well... You're just taking advantage of the situation. Um, I can't entirely deny that, but... Then that settles it. You'll do business with us at market prices, and that's final. We should seal the deal with a smile, too, since it matters so much to him. Like this. Uh, much obliged. <laughs> That's awesome. I like this game a lot. At least, I, uh, at least if I can do his voice. At these prices. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, how, how you doing? I'm going in the rids. <laughs> All right, cool. I think I, I don't have to. I, guys, I do want to, like, practice that. You know, voice acting, because I oh man, it'd be really cool if I could, you know, really entertain you guys with my full uh, potential. But with that, 
that being said, uh, I can't do the voice at all. I'm gonna practice this uh, off screen. I gotta really practice with these voices. These voices are like so creative and so innovative. <laughs> I don't know what that word means. I'm just saying it because it sounds, uh, it, it just rhymes. Anyway, Emmer Belt. This could be useful. How about two of these? I already have two of these, and I'm already using them. Let's buy more. I can only buy one. Welp. Ship. <laughs> Alright, that's all I want. I'm outie. Wait. Enhance. Foreign daggers. Um. Oh, sweet. Awesome. And that's it. That's all we can do here. Yep. Alright, moving on. Alright, we're ready. I think. I hope. Uh, <laughs> you sure know how to drive a hard bargain, Velvet. What else was I supposed to do? Would you rather I devoured him and swiped all his stuff? You're more frightening than the Reaper. Still, that Turtles was an interesting guy. It's a big world, kid. A lot of strange folks out there. So I'm discovering. <laughs> he probably took one look at us and thought the very same thing. A demon, a Moloch, and a Reaper. We've got it all. Ain't that the truth? He spoke out of turn. This kid, he might be warm up on us, guys. What are turtles, anyway? Some sort of turtle men. Yeah, but what are they? They are what they are. All you need to know is that they're good at peddling things. They're probably just called turtles because they wear all those sea turtle shells on their backs. After all, Rokuro means sixth son, and that's what I am. I was Teresa's second tethered Malakim, so I was number two. That's a title, not a name. Huh? Would someone just give the kid a name already? A name? For me? <sighs> Velvet name him, please! Velvet, name the boy, please. I have a feeling what she's gonna name him. That's why I want her to name him so bad. It's gonna, ooh, if she actually gets another name, I think she's gonna give him. I'm gonna cry, dude. I'm a freaking, I'm a, oh man, that's gonna be a waterfall, dude. I don't know, dude. Oh, dude, I'm excited. I'm already crying. Just thinking about it, the excitement has me in tears. Just name the boy. I know I'm supposed to be going outside, probably, but I want to explore and I want to see if I can find a cat's. Ah, ship, dude. <laughs> ship, four benches, cakes. I want this treasure. 640 gal, dude. I'll finish this quick. We're finished here. Let's go. Whoops. All right. Uh, warp where? What the fork tunnel? <laughs> uh, I, you know, I will look that up, but I don't really uh, want to go anywhere too far. Oh man, I need someone to make great leaps of justice. Whatever. Let's go ahead and uh, leave this cave now. I think we've explored enough. Oh shit, dude. Don't blame me if this goes sour. Don't worry about it, buddy. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about a thing. Do I sing that a lot? I feel like I probably do. Also, it turns out those green things that come from the ceiling, they're called um whoops. They're called seeds. Interesting, right? No? Well, I didn't think so. Oh, 
That wasn't worth the effort. All right, so uh, this kid here just earned a title. I've got to give him a title. I think it was an equipment. Uh, let me see what it does for him. Nope, nothing. Nothing good. Yep. All right, cool. So I'm gonna go with this one. Uh, we already checked you. Sweet. He is the will of earth and wind. <laughs> Go figure. Looks like you die. Come on, really? All right, I just got another title. Wow, this time for Velvet. But it's nothing good. All right, well, never mind. Let's move on. Wow, what a letdown. I'm all, I'm all, I feel all mundane and uh, freaking whatever. Um, is there a, nope, but this is good though. This is good for us. Guys, let's check this out. Let's see what this, oops, mm -hmm. this is. All right, sweet. I'm not. I don't know why I keep switching back to Velvet so fast so soon. I, it's just weird. I'm, I'm weird, guys, okay? You caught me, you caught me. I'm fracking weird, I don't understand. <laughs> Well, at least our, uh, I did explain myself already. Uh, I do feel more comfortable looking at, uh, looking at a girl's backside than a guy's backside. I just, it's like, I don't know. I don't know. It's just a warm feeling in my heart. Something weird. It's just, it's just, you know, I feel at home, alright? I just feel at home. <laughs> Take that as you will, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what that means. That's just like I can explain it. Your style is really unique. Just wait until I pull out the good stuff. Okay, cool. That's done. Come free. I haven't had, uh, yeah. Looks like Eifried's first mate has a strange superstition. It's just a habit. Only comes up tails anyway. What land did that coin come from? I've never seen a coin with a goddess on one side and the reaper on the other. Strictly speaking, that's not the reaper on the back. It's an image of the demon king, Daos. Where have I heard that name before? Martel the goddess, and Daos the demon king. The Book of Ragnarok, Chapter 765. The Battle of Idrisil. Whoa, you're awfully well read. The coin was dug up from some ancient ruins in another land. They called the place Carlin long ago. It's made from soft, ordinary gold, but they had some process to harden the metal and make it resistant to scratches. Wow, that's a rather rare find then. Do you like to read books? Teresa's chamber was full of them, so I spent a lot of time reading. Ragnarok is a record of battles from the Age of Myth. I've read it several times now. <laughs> anyway, coins like that are hard to come by. Where did you get it? It's a long story. Never mind then. So, were you deciding something with that coin toss? Not anything I can talk about yet. Oh, I'm sorry for prying. 
Alright, well, we all are just, you know, getting comfortable with each other, aren't we? But <laughs> they'll be like, oh, long story? Never mind. Do do do. Where are we a jerk? No, it's fine. I, uh, maybe he doesn't. It's, we got no time to explain his story, so it's, it's okay. I understand. Whoa. Did I just turn, go in a circle? I didn't. This looks beautiful as frunk. And you know what else? Well, no. I was actually going to end the video off here, but there's still a lot more to go to go through at this current moment in time. So let's go. Let's continue on and go this way. Now, I do want to go by those knights over there. I knew your enemy. Fork you. Well, but that one up there isn't. I guess I'll fight you because you're new. All right, let's do this. You're fighting the Reaper. Now, these actually don't... Uh, no, these are like some things I fought in uh, Televzilia. Oh, the Symphonia. It was one of those games. But, you know, they weren't threatening then, and they're not threatening now. Obviously, the weakness is fire. Because, uh, boy. That was my version of uh, Doi, which is uh, another version of Duh. Come on, really? Excuse me. All right, cool. Uh, these guys look crazy. All right, well, oh, I guess I'm not gonna go get souls this time. There's okay, no guard. Fine. Do we just go in? Wait, this isn't what I expected. There's a barrier over it. They changed the security. You weren't kidding, were you? That scorpion and this barrier, all part of your curse. You'll be lucky if that's the worst of it. A direct assault would be a bad idea. What's the plan? Down the cliff, there should be an entrance used during the fortress's construction. We'll check that. You did your it research. I had to, didn't I? Well, where do, you, where do you say to go? Cliffside? Use the server of entrance below the cliff. Yeah, okay, we're going our right way. I actually want to go this way because I saw souls, but okay. I was supposed to go this way, then I don't see why the fork not. Anyway, um, next time on Telebrazuria, we are going to see try and infiltrate this weird, this weird, strange fortress. I'll see you guys then.